rolling. I'm here. rolling. Ready? Yeah. All right. Hey guys, it's Jordan Rager, and this week we're going to see what got a small town talking in my home state of Georgia. <laughs> Georgia man accused of running a Ponzi scam and frat house. Georgia man arrested seven times for impersonating a police officer. See, my thing is, is it took y'all seven times to figure out he wasn't a real cop. Like, I feel like that's, I feel like that's somebody else's fault. Let's do some investigating here. 17 years old, he was impersonating a cop. 17 years old, I was running from the cops. <laughs> Not running, hiding. Avoiding, really. <laughs> this is a good one. Georgia man tries to run on the tarmac to board a plane at Hartsfield Jackson while it's taking off. <laughs> All I can see in my head is um, the Jim Carrey movie Liar Liar. He's he steals the staircase and. That's amazing. I love that one. <laughs> this is not funny, but it's making me laugh, which probably says a lot about me. Georgia man fires pistol when wife brings him the wrong barbecue ribs. I mean, man wants his ribs. It also doesn't say that he shot her, so he's at least got that going for him. Georgia man does not realize New England is part of the USA. Come on, man. You're making the rest of us look bad. <laughs> Georgia man arrested for feeding cocaine and whiskey to a goat. <laughs> why? Just, that's my only question is why? <laughs> this can't, this can't be real. This cannot be real. Georgia man assaults his mother with a pork chop. So you guys can't see the picture, but it makes it that much better. This, the picture of the suspect is him going. <laughs> <laughs> Assaulted her with a pork chop. Oh, another runs himself over story. Georgia man runs himself over after attempting to steal a beer truck. Oh, he actually got away with it. Like, he, he, he stole the truck successfully, but then the truck ran him over when he drove to a local Bojangles to get breakfast. This story just gets better and better. <laughs> so he steals a beer truck from a gas station, drives that beer truck to a Bojangles, where he gets out casually to get breakfast, but he forgot to put the truck in the park and it ran over him. <laughs> Uh, Georgia man shoved five bags of frozen shrimp down his pants at a family dollar. Also, five bags? How big were these bags? How big were his pants? And they were frozen. That had to be, that had to be cold. Is there anything that you or your friends did that would have been a headline? Uh, oh, absolutely, but I can't talk about any of it. You can't talk about any of them? No. no. There's not even one? See, the difference is, is me and my buddies did stuff like this, but we never got caught. <laughs> <laughs> I did not assault my mother with a pork chop, though. Jesus, Lord. Georgia man mistakes whiskey bottle for child, buckles bottle into car seat instead of son. <laughs> I feel like that had to be the start of one of the DUI stories that we read earlier. <laughs> All right, so that was what got small towns talking in the state of Georgia. Check out my brand new single, Small Town Talking, available now. <laughs>